Star Ghana with their governance and transparency and accountability program also gracefully decided to support the government assurance committee. We met in Sokankope in April to decide how best we can work and make sure this committee does its work well. The committee decided that we will come out with rules or procedures before we start our public engagement. For over a year, the committee has engaged consultants to come up with rules of procedures for the committee. And the rules of procedures will be used by members, the general public, and ministers of state. Because we found out that in our standing orders, we just talked about only promises assurance, which was not detailed. We came out with detailed assurances, detailed promises, and what really constitutes undertakings. With this, we will now be fully prepared to work with ministers and with parliament. Over the years, we all know that Ghanaians, especially the, the electorate, begins to have doubt whether the elected officials are up and doing, especially parliament that's supposed to have oversight responsibility over the executive. People are beginning to feel that parliament, parliament does not have teeth to bite. This committee is a committee that's supposed to put ministers on their toes, especially when it comes to promises and undertakings. We have today finished with our rules of proceedings and decided that we will be in Western region to launch our rules of proceedings. In addition to that, we've also noticed that we need citizens' feedback in this discourse. And therefore, we have also con contracted Pen Plus Byte to come out with electronic platform that can help us to engage with citizens. This will also be demonstrated to all of us today to see how we can engage with citizens as to the promises and assurances made by the various ministers at various places. Mr. Honor, Honor, Honorable Regional Minister, colleagues, this committee has done its work and have decided now, the 28th of May this month, we'll have our first public sitting to meet with ministers who have made some assurances to the state. We want to use this opportunity after launching that all of you should watch the program live. With this, honorable colleagues, we have come to Western Region to launch the rules of procedures. I want to use this opportunity to thank all those who have supported us, more especially Star Ghana, and the consultants who helped us to draft these rules of procedures, and our friends from Pen Plus Byte who have developed the, the program for us. We want to thank you all for coming, and we hope we we'll continue to be partners in governance of this nation. Thank you very much.